Hi everybody, it's Kev here. Welcome to the Inspired Healing Podcast. And if you've been following me, you know that I'm talking about Amelia Earhart the last uh, two or three days. Really inspiring lady, a real pioneering aviator. And she does continue to hold that kind of uh, a mythic place in popular imagination. She was the first woman to fly solo across the Atlantic Ocean. And her legendary feats, they really are the very emblem of courage. And she is a woman who refused to let fears and adversity ground her dreams, stop her dreams. And so many people today let those fears and that adversity stop them from becoming the best they can be. And here's one of her quotes that I absolutely love. And it really does say a lot about the person she is. There's more to life than being a passenger. It's short and sweet, but it just sums up so much. There's more to life than being a passenger. And it kind of correlates to the Theodore Roosevelt man in the arena quote that I spoke about uh, a week or so ago, where he talks about being in the arena rather than being up in the stands, just being a spectator. And it's the same with this quote. There's more to life than being a passenger. And yet so many people are passengers. You often hear commentators in football talking about, you know, oh, so-and-so was a passenger today. He wasn't really in the game. That's what that quote means. There are so many people on the periphery of life not jumping in. They're just sitting back. They're a passenger. They're a spectator, just watching the world go by, watching their life go by. And as I said, Amelia Earhart, she just refused to bow down to those fears and that adversity. She jumped in the arena. She was in the cockpit of her own plane, flying her own plane, making her dreams come true, creating her own future. And this is back in an age where men dominated You know, the skies were, you know, both literally and figuratively considered the domain of men. She set record after record on her drive to show that women could aspire to all the same heights as men. In 1923, at the age of only 26, Earhart became only the 16th woman in the world to be issued a pilot's license. Five years later, she absolutely skyrocketed to fame after becoming the first woman to fly over the Atlantic, as well as the first person to fly over both the Pacific and Atlantic Oceans. So she flew against those prevailing mentalities. You know, she believed passionately in the capacity of women to be as fearless as men in chasing their dreams and making their own way in the world. She was an author, lecturer, poet, airline industry vice president. She was never a passenger. And as I said, back in those days, the role of a woman was to be seen as just being at home, looking after the kids, a housewife. And she changed all that. There's more to life than being a passenger. So get inspired by someone like Amelia Earhart. See what she's done. Why aren't you doing it? Why can't you do a similar thing? Why can't you have an impact on the world? Why can't you do the thing that you love to do? That's what she did. She loved flying. It was a hobby, but it was also an income and a great lucrative income for her as well. So take note of that quote, stick it up on your fridge. There's more to life than being a passenger. Jump in the driver's seat, start creating your own life, the life that you want. Be the best you. See you tomorrow. Well, I really hope you enjoyed today's podcast. If you did, please subscribe and leave a review. That really does help us. And also share it with your family and friends. That would be great. And please support my sponsor, Prostate Plus. Prostate Plus supplements really can help shrink your prostate. I use them myself to great effect. The links to Prostate Plus are down below in the show notes. Thanks for listening. See you next time.